When bad weather strikes, drivers face obstacles, of course, on the road, but imagine being handicapped, facing obstacles in everyday life. Well, the snow just adds to their frustrations. News 10's Jane Santucci has one woman's story. Life is full of challenges every day for people like Mary Steppy of Terre Haute. Mary is handicapped and has to use a wheelchair to get around. Calculate where the back end is here. Getting into her vehicle is only half the challenge. The other half is parking. This would be the ideal situation to go shopping for her. Pull into a parking lot and plenty of spaces are available. Except it's not always that easy, especially in the snow. Handicapped spots get abused more than even when there's snow on the ground. Some drivers park legitimately, others may not. It's cold out. People are um, not wanting to track through the snow. Sometimes people may not know they're breaking the law. It's also helpful to park farther away from the handicap line for those, like Mary, who have lifts. It's going to take another three and a half feet. So we're talking about seven feet for me to exit from my vehicle. Without that extra space, Mary can't get in or out. If I don't have that amount of room to do that, then I just will have to park somewhere else. And that's not the purpose of these spaces. Unfortunately, Mary believes the handicapped parking problem is an issue that will not be closed shut anytime soon. In Terre Haute with photojournalist John Tim, Jane Santucci, News 10. Now, drivers, listen up. If you're caught parking in a handicapped spot illegally, you face a fine ranging from $100 to $500.